I imagine if you throw a baseball, you don't go, right? Your arm goes back, so it winds back first, and then it moves forward, so it's like a circular motion. Same thing with playing the cello and with shifting. So you don't just go, oh God, I have to shift, and then you just move up like a, like a robot, right? That just like goes up in preparation for shifting, because we know we're gonna shift. There's a tiny, I, I'm being very dramatic right now, so it's not this big, but it's this type of circular movement. It goes up, because once your arm is already here, it's a lot easier to shift because this this is already in place. You just go like that. So you're actually closer to the note that you're gonna reach. And that um, is super helpful when you make huge shifts. So if you're going. So if you're just trying to go. It's, it's gonna be uh, very, very awkward, right? So you wanna have this kind of circular movement so you can practice that. 